back to my insanity. Okay, let's see here, Doctor. Oh, hello. I don't hear the assimilated enderman. I still hear the ruptor. Ruptor viscera. It's still here! It's still here! God damn it! sound. Gives you slowness. Good intel. Yeah, no one gave a comment telling me that I could enter peaceful mode, so yeah, we immediately got right into the action, didn't we? Probably means I should have dealt with the issue, but I didn't. 
probably should have. Knowing our issue is in a very critical state. What's this drumming noise? Crazy. Are we special or something? What can we use this for? Lure, weakened. Pause evolution points for approximately 10 seconds. Yeah, how very wonderful of an idea. Let's do that. Something inside me tells me that placing a lure down right by my base is a terrible idea. It stopped. The drumming stopped when I placed down the lure. And now it's back. Wait. Could it be linked to its evolution? Oh no. That means it's getting... Well, obviously it was getting stronger. Oh god. Still poorer than a than an African village with no clean water. There's thunder. Wunderbar. Ugh, I hate that noise. So what is even the point of that? Piece of crafting material. Can do anything with ruptor viscera? No. Just make a fucking lure. That's it. Just lure. Wait, what makes this infected flesh different than the other one? Yeah, it's back to doing so. I really don't like this. Like at all. But hey. Actually, I never thought I'd see- I never thought I'd see the day where I'd actually be happy to see a creeper for once. Finally, a vanilla mob. And about 
enough time too. Got some gunpowder. What can we do with that? We can make fire charges, make TNT, the EFLN, VN, VTNT, high concentration of vulcanite makes black unstable. Manage with caution. Oh, that's great. And then we can just make splash potions. Okay. Subtle beating of drums. Or if an office starts, you know. Whatever. I guess no matter what, I'm just stuck here, right? I just can't do anything about it. Good. Fucking no. Actually. A better idea just to go back home, type slash kill, head back, and, and immediately go out and try and explore. Probably with no armor. <laughs> Probably a terrible idea, but you know. And then I'll put my crafting grid of this thing. I mean, it's worth it. I get all my health back. My saturation's returned. And I'm a lot more ready to fight parasites to some extent. I'm not a fan of the, close, the uh, ghost block glitch that was fixed in a later version. You know, you probably want to hear the thunder. Even if the fucking rain's annoying. Thunder. Oh God! It's right near me. It's tracking me. I saw it going in and out fast on my mini map. a yellow dot zipping around at quick speeds makes me think something's here following me it's them please creator of the mod known as escape and run parasites please nerf the fuck out of the assimilated enderman please Actually, wait, should it even spawn at stage one? I mean, I know I'm at stage three, but let me, I can't config. I cannot configure the file or the mod. Damn it. I was hoping I could so I could tone down the Enderman, assimilated Enderman spawn rate.
Is it really any different from the spawn we were just at? <laughs> no. Not at all. You know, ocean travel like this reminds me heavily of RL craft. The fact that I'm looking around constantly in fear of like an assimilated Enderman just showing up and beating my ass and stealing my boat. Like, come on, it's my boat. It's all I've got now. I probably should have taken the wooden sword. Yeah, probably. Oh well. Too late to regret that action, huh? single village, as if a village is going to do anything for me. Because I doubt a village is going to help in any situation here, dude. Don't say it. Don't, don't fucking say it, dude. You're just gonna jinx yourself and cause your terrible fucking luck to strike you and smite you from the heavens. Because God isn't merciful to you. We've seen that in action. Case example right to my left. Though for some reason... Wait. Yeah, yeah, no. Never mind. Never mind. Nope. Uh uh. I was about to say, why is the assimilated villager not attacking the cows? Then I remembered, wait, they could be disguised. Because that's something the parasites can do. I read up on that. I know for a fact they can just disguise willingly. What even is there for me to get out of this? I don't know, maybe some string if I'm lucky? Probably should have just gone to the abandoned mine chef, but knowing my luck, I was probably gonna get killed off a lot down there. Especially when that thing's around. Oh my god! Skeletons! I never thought I'd be happy to see a fucking skeleton of all things! I fucking hate skeletons, and I'm actually glad I see one! It's a breath of fresh air! And what I just heard is not a breath of fresh air! It's a breath of radioactive air. Not safe to breathe, you know. Damn. Should've wore the gas mask. There's a spruce tree over yonder. We're coming up to what looks like a desert biome. A village. And a blacksmith too. Right by the church. It's got a blacksmith. Oh, God. I'm gonna 
want to get the fuck out. Or if possible, I could just bait him from the safety of my boat. Bait him into coming over. There's a creeper. Why is the ruptor so fast in water? Wait, can the ruptors- Oh my god, those fuckers can jump! Oh god, no. No. No! Why can you jump so high? Fuckers are like fucking professional basketball players! I guess that puts a hold on this expedition. There's some good shit in that blacksmith. I I can fucking guarantee there's some good shit in there if there's so many fucking parasites. Oh god no, not you. Not you. I'm out. No. There's an assimilated enderman back there. No, no. I'm going home. 3,000 blocks away? Good. Why am I debating something? Why? Why am I debating going back? I'm just gonna get my ass handed to me. There's nothing I could do against that. <sighs> There's exactly one thing I can do, but I won't. No matter how badly I want to, I won't. You think we could uh, abuse the render distance? Because mobs won't be able to aggro onto you if they're outside of your render distance. So sometimes it's beneficial to play on a render distance of two. So that way you don't get aggroed onto by certain mobs. Terrible idea to say that they're gone because they're fucking not. Why are they not attacking the squids? Shouldn't they be attacking the squids? Oh, they are fast in the water. Like we got Dolphin's Grace or some shit. No, 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 that's a lie. That is a fucking lie I'm being told right there. No, that, that is a disguised Enderman. That, that fucker is disguised, I swear it. I swear to God, that fucker's disguised. That Enderman right there is disguised. I still won't look it in the eye because it's disguised. I know that. It's disguised. <sighs> see? See? It fucking was. It aggroed onto me. <laughs> if I can swim at least <sighs> boat far enough away. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's just teleporting right next to me. Great. Next, it's gonna teleport in front of me. Or not? Oh! Fuck! <laughs> Shit! See? See? It fucking teleported on top of me! It teleported in front of me. doesn't feel fair. Not at all. Fuck it. I'm being a bitch. 
I really fucking hate the assimilated Enderman, dude. I just can't. I can't. It fucking breaks me. It fucks with me mentally. I just... I can't deal with it. I know. I'm fucking scared. I'm a scared little bitch. I know. Because I can't handle a fucking tall, deformed black male. Or black guy. Or thing. Yeah, I know. I'm scared. I'm scared of Sha uh, Shaquille O'Neal with fucking Down Syndrome. Yeah, I know. I'm scared of that. There's actually a few uh, villagers in here. How? Uh, I'm just gonna... I need room to breathe. I'm sorry. I don't... I don't think I can take it anymore. I will steal all these crops, though. You guys can't even respawn. Something fought it. But whatever fought it is dead now. That's for certain. What even is there to this island now? What even is there to do here that isn't die? They're gonna spawn back in the second I set it to, pe to uh, easy. So I'm not really motivated for anything here. Sorry, lads. It's nice knowing you. I guess. Actually, what I can just do instead is... No, I need my boat. I need my boat. Oh, this is under me. Sweet. Uh, yeah. It's all for now. Yay, we're back. And, uh... Is safe. There we go. <sighs> Jesus Christ. If you consider how I feel during this whole fucking thing I've been forcing myself upon, I feel like I need a fucking break. I I I don't have the mental willpower for this. I am totally not mentally prepared for this. I am not in the slightest mentally prepared. Is another safe at least? It's probably safe. I assume it might be, anyway. Okay, they're back. Good to know. This didn't let up for a second.
be able to get it when easily. I have gravel nearby. And I thought I had gravel in here, but I guess not. Saddle. That's a funny joke. Put a saddle in a fucking blacksmith chest. Yeah, that's a good fucking joke. Even though whatever the fuck I could saddle is probably, you know, non-existent now. Horses? No. Pigs? Gone. I guess I'm just a vegan now. I have become the very thing I swore to destroy in arguments. <laughs> I can make a bucket. But I don't have any diamonds or anything. I'm just poor. I'm poor, downtrodden. I don't got shit. I don't even have a fucking bed. You were underneath me this whole time! Oh, good thing you don't know how stairs work. Or can you not get up? It's back! Why are you always here to torment me? <sighs> I really don't like doing this. But I've done it once. Sorry. I'm fucking unable to handle the fucking assimilated Enderman. I just don't like that it spawns so often and torments me so much. It's gonna give me... A fucking Vietnam flashback or some shit. I feel like a fucking veteran of fucking Vietnam or some shit. With how many times I'm getting fucking, you know, tormented by this fucking monstrosity. A stack of torches. I can find a swamp, I can probably make mossy cobblestone. Right? Mossy. Oh, damn it. Moss stone, yeah. Moss stone requires cobblestone and vines. And ball of moss can be made from this, which 
Right click on a bookshelf with this and convert into mending moss, which consumes 10 levels. Then I can apply it to any tool of my choosing, and then boom, I've got mending. Nothing. Great. Oh, let's just be kind of. Oh, great. We're under the ocean. Slabs. How about Janusite's here? I never thought I'd be mining so much fucking andesite. Oh, there's Altaris here. Jeez, how is there so much Altaris? Is it always behind andesite? Or coated in andesite? If so, that would have been super good to know. And now with all this, I can make polished andesite, which means I can make polished andesite slabs. Can I not make fucking slabs out of polished andesite? Are you fucking kidding me? So I just grab this shit for nothing? In assumption I can make a slab out of it? No way, right? No fucking way. All shandesite. I can't even make a slab out of it. What the fuck? Why did I even have it? Go away. It's not efficient. I'm sorry, but it's just not. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing here. But, I can at least try something, you know? I think it's just better to, you know, just dig downward from here. Yeah. Oh, phosphorite. Doesn't really help much. Wait, does it? What can I even make out of this? Again, just phosphorus lanterns and confused Ignatius. Okay. Earth area of moth spawning. Yeah, that's that's kind of helpful. Gives me a slight break, I suppose. Near my base. like 
22 mods I've got on this. Silver. I'm unsure if the parasites are affected by smite, but if they are, I finally unlocked a counter, I suppose. Silver does additional damage to the undead, so... Uh, I'm very unsure if it would count as them being undead. But they're not holy. That's, that's, that's for sure. There's no doubting that. Oh, God. Scolium. The infusion metal. We don't get much, but we get a mining level diamond. Infuscolium dust. Can we even do anything with this? No. Not at all. Infuscolium crystals. What can we even do with this shit? that needs diamond. He's not telling me the mining level required, but... Oh. Lapis. That's super good, actually. Ability 8. I need to try and preserve this. Huh. This is gonna break, and I need to spend some very precious iron. Sulfur. Still need to wait. Still can't mine that. Let's head up. Just give me a, a little break, please. That's all I need. My mental stability is. Low as it is, I don't think I can go further on. Because of how much torment I've been suffering from with these parasites. The parasites have been tormenting me for days. Specifically, uh, seven of them. Well, six days actually, but oh well, yeah, well, five actually. A break is more than needed, in my opinion. A break is purely essential. Consider me an overachiever, if you will, but I'm no overachiever. That's fucking bullshit. Overachiever is not a way you'd describe me. Determined? I wouldn't say that either. Persevered? Or littered with perseverance? No. Not at all. Not a single bit. I know it sounds like I'm selling myself short. Because I am. I do that a lot. It's nothing unnatural for me. Why 
there's so many. All of this is growing up in my fucking house. Holy shit. Oh my god. <laughs> nice of you to join us, Minecraft Cave Sound. Because today I found manganese. It was actually fucking helpful. Yeah, comfortable handling the iron pickaxe. So much of this shit. Fuck assist. What the fuck is this? Cut it off, then maybe. I don't know. Very wishful thinking on my part. Maybe that gets rid of the water. Most of it, anyway. Obstruction from water. Honestly, now it feels like I'm actually playing Minecraft. Well, yeah, mining. Oh, that's wonderful. More of you. Goodbye. Oh. It's all hanging by a thread, I bet. A mere piece of string. God, I don't really like how oppressive moving in water is in, like, the earlier versions of Minecraft, before 1.13. I feel like it's the version my PC can handle the best, just before 1.13. I don't know, you could just float, you dick. Floating over the hell that. 
that led to. Before I mind that, I have an idea. I'm going to give my pickaxe the effect lock before I grab that. Lapis. Now we've got so much more lapis. Oh yeah. Now we can immediately rock luck. One still, but you know. It's the thought that counts, doesn't it? Delete. Confirm deletion. I'm unsure if you can see from the handle, but um, the handle now has a bit of flu at the bottom. Which is pretty cool. Brassium. And I'm not going to be able to get, like, firewood, which is unfortunate. Well, actually, I could. I just need to make a, a melter. But that's, that's it. That's all I need. I just need a melter. Well, I won't be able to get much alloying done, so that's another problem of my own volition. Because in order to make firewood, you need lava wood. Lava wood needs to be, well, in a casting basin. And it needs to be covered in lava, which I don't have. And then we need two blaze powders, which means that it's a nether item. got nearly a stack and a half of coal. We're good for, we're good on coal for a while. Okay, come on. Just enough of that, please. swarmed with so much water. Mainly because the water is so oppressive in this version and earlier versions than that. Nowadays it just makes me scared to fucking, you know, break blocks while I'm under the water. Because all my torches could go bye-bye. Point proven. We're 
heading down to Y-17. Thanks so much, Water, for being such a dick. Yep, I fucking saw that coming. It's literally just one layer of gravel, really. Just a single layer, or layer, eh, layer of gravel.
break this block or the block above it. I'm just going to be trapped here. Uh, so now I got to wait. I'm out of torches. No matter. I can just make more. All right. So what does Sam even do that? Wyatt, and we're at Y11, which was in this version before the Caves and Cliffs update. Oh my god, there's more lapis. <laughs> and I can't do shit. Uh, fine, I'll make a waypoint here. There's still more lapis. Jesus Christ. Look, more rain. Okay, we got luck. or not smelting, but a uh, better mining speeds. Though if I invest it onto this pickaxe, it's just gonna fucking break the damn game. Because I'm just gonna insta-mine the shit out of so much netherrack and I don't got shit to do with it. Actually, would netherrack tools actually be better? Because netherrack tools deal more damage to anything that is not native to the nether. So if its natural home is not the nether, then it will deal additional damage. So to blazes it just it just does normal damage, but to zombies it just does more damage. Type of thing, you know? Oh look, there's a poppy down here. Yay. A flower. In these trying times. down here, but I guess not. Hmm, a pity. Might need to make a long sword so I could 
do some good damage, but then give it some redstone so I can give it some, uh, you know, attack speed bonuses. Oh look, or Calcum.
can't just pause recording.